Hi and welcome to my video. It is still Saturday, March 4th. This is my second video for today and it is also a Michaels haul video. It is the second $10 box that I bought even though I promised myself I wouldn't buy any of them at the $10 price. Um, I did. I couldn't resist. Uh, blame it on YouTube because <laughs> I watched YouTube videos. Here's what's in my box. This second box. Something in this box smells good. Um, Ashland Moss. Here. That's kind of neat. $6.99. If you do all of the greenery type crafting, this is kind of cool. It's a Spanish moss. $6.99 was the regular price on that. Um, oh, pom pom plate craft. Okay. So it has all of this good stuff in it, which you can stop the video and look at. I'm not going to keep stopping it. Um,. I would never do this, but I would definitely steal the parts and pieces out of it for that. I like the, I like that pom pom. I don't think I've ever seen that color before. There's some ribbon in here. I'm not sure how long it is, but I'd steal that too. Something glittery in there. Definitely going to investigate that further. Um, oh. Ah. Okay. I think this is what smells good. I'm not going to be able to get it all in the camera, so I'll just kind of twist it around a little bit. Twist, 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 twist. It is, I'll show you the tag here, a red berry foliage garland. And it was $39.99, which I would never pay. Um, but man, it smells really good. I might hang that up in the bathroom until the scent goes away. I'm not going to put it in a box for sure. I think this is it. Yeah, it's definitely coming to some smell from that. It's that maybe that, or it may have come from. Let me grab this next thing out of here. These pine cones. I wonder if these. Oh, I'm getting little little pieces are falling out everywhere. Um, let me see. Oh yeah, no, it's pine cones. Those smell really good, and it, they're broken. Open the bag is broken open, but this is cool. My husband really likes the scented pine cones. So, I'm definitely going to keep those out. Oh, I'm getting little bits of stuff everywhere. So, oh, I'm sorry. This one was $6.99. And I bought these. I buy these every year. Um, so, I think I pay normally around $3. Maybe $3.99. Uh, I buy them. Because, like I said, my husband likes these. So, I buy them scented every year. And I think the ones I bought this year were $3.99. So, I paid $3.99. So, there, I've got a, what, um, two-thirds the price of my box pack. Oh, <laughs> I saw this in the bag, in the box. And um, it's definitely going in the donation box for me. I actually don't like it, but maybe you do. <clears throat> so that would be a cool surprise for you, right? It was $9.99 for, I think, just this one piece. So, um, very cool if you like that kind of stuff. And some creatology. Okay, now this I do like. This is a, okay, let me give you the price before I forget. $12.99. It is an ornament frame craft kit. It has 174 foam stickers, 12 foam shapes, 12 uh, almost 10 inch cording, and an instruction sheet. So I would guess it makes 12 pieces. So that's pretty cool. I, I like this. And um, this one, another craft kit. Even if I didn't like all, you know, making make these, I would definitely steal all these pieces and parts out of it. It has, um, this is the stuff in it. Hopefully it's in focus so you can stop the video and take a look at it. But, um, oh, it has 16 double-sided adhesive stickers. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. I like it. I like both of those on that one. Great for the classroom. Um, oh, oh look. Um, I saw these in Stay Stacy's video. I don't know if she got those exact ones. Pretty sure those were in her video. Um, let me see. I'm digging through and getting more out. Oh, because everybody needs, like, very cool. Okay. <laughs> I'll be donating those. Unless my daughter wants to keep some of those. But um, I 
think they're all ornaments. There's the tag. I don't know if that'll be in focus enough, but I'll try. Paper, very cool. Okay, keep that. Um, oh, it's chalkboard. Huh. I think I got rid of all the chalk. But um, two ninety nine DIY plastic ornament. I don't mean to be negative. Sorry. Um, that's kind of neat. I've never seen anything like that before. Oh. Now I'm gonna have to find some chalk. That actually is fun. You could put a little message and change it. That's kind of fun. It's definitely. A... Now I wish I hadn't put all my Christmas stuff away in the crawl space. I have to go down there and add that to it. Oh. Okay. Another ornament. That makes what six. They're different sizes though. So, well, there's the little, and there's the bigger. So, here we go. Oh, sorry, yeah, that was six. So, oh, okay. It's three big, three little. And a clear one. Oh, another chalkboard one. Oh, one of them oh. <laughs> Seven. And I'm really trying to dig out all these. So there's two chalkboard ones. Did I give you the price on these? Two ninety nine. And the ornaments were or sorry, the oh look, two forty nine. You can see it right there. Two forty nine where I'm at. There we go. That's the big one and the little one. Each. Um, there's these. These are two ninety nine. And there are several of these. I actually did want these. So there's this. Oh, this is not, I don't know. This just has the hook. It doesn't have the thing. So it's just a ball. Oh, I kind of like that. I like it better. There are, oh, and there's two of them. I'm definitely going to have to YouTube that and see what I can do with these. Same with these. I know there's lots of cute crafts. So there's two big ones, two little ones. The little ones are $1.99, and the big ones were $2.99. Of course, I wouldn't have paid that. And these round balls were $1.99. So um, I think that's it for those. Uh, there's a couple big things in here, so let me get those out of the way. Oh, let's see. There was two big, oh, I said that. Two big, two little, two round. Okay. Um, another garland. I won't get it all in shot. But it's... There we go. It's cute. Oh my god. It was $22.99. Gotta assume I would have paid 50% off if I wanted it, so um, $11.50, right? Not a bad deal. If it was something that I wanted, I probably wouldn't use it as a garland. I We'll hang on to it for a little bit and think about what I might want to use with it, but I would probably take it apart and do something with it if I were to keep it. Um, if I'm not going to get that much value out of it, I'd rather donate it and let someone else enjoy it and hopefully help someone else out in the process. And, oh, okay, so the last two things are big. There is, da -da -da, this was originally $39.99. It is a plaid tree skirt. A little soft edge right on the edge. Well, I have a red, very traditional tree skirt, fluffy, soft. Oh, I'm going blank. It's not felt. Uh, it's not flannel, really. I guess it's a brushed flannel tree skirt that I always use. Um, so um, I'm definitely going to keep this one because this is pretty cool. If I don't use it as a tree skirt, I'll figure out something else to do with it. Like it, like it. The um, lady who checked me out said she, um, so apparently she told me that they're not allowed to buy the boxes, which that makes sense, you know, um, since they're filling the boxes. Um, I could understand why Michaels would do that. But um, she said she bought this when it was on super clearance, too. She really likes hers, and it is really pretty. So very nice, because it was peeking out of the side of the box that she, you know, was telling me about it. We didn't, we didn't open this box or anything. Uh, and then the last thing in this, which I think is really cool. Look, it's a pillow. I'll never get it all on camera. 
It says, oh, let me see. Mary and, oh, here, I'll go this way. Mary and, not right, but bright. So it's a, let's see, 16 inch pillow. Nice. Um, it was $26.99. And I went, I do actually really like this because, um, because I sew, obviously, by fabric bias. Um, and I spent, I made pillows for my classroom. Uh, maybe I'll post those videos. Um, I did make videos, um, but I usually only publish them to my sister. <laughs> so, um, but I made lots and lots of pillow covers for um, putting pillows in my classroom to do read around the room. Um, and so I do like having this. I already have covers made for it, although they're already on other pillows that I bought. I actually went from Goodwill to Goodwill to Value Village looking for the cheapest pillows I could find that I could just throw in the washer, wash and clean up. And then I recovered them, or in some cases I ripped them open and created a new pillow, which I stuffed and then covered because um, I want everything to be washable. Um, in the classroom and um, so this is something I would actually use oh, I have a ton of pillows in my classroom but if I don't use it in my classroom I'll make it for someone else to use in theirs if they want it so that's my second I shouldn't have spent the money but that's okay every, every once in a while you gotta have some fun right um, and I hope you enjoyed it I had fun I think it was worth ten dollars to me um, even if I do or don't use all this stuff, I will be happy to donate what I don't use. And um, I think it'll be great. So I hope you are having a great time wherever and whenever you are at. And um, I hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.